open and closed curves and polygons curves polygons curves we normally come across certain lines which are not straight in our life for example a garland a snake a leaf or a petal of a flower all these lines which are not straight are called as curves if a curve does not cross itself it is called a simple curve these curves are simple curves and the curves that cross itself are called as non simple curves curves are of two types one open curve and two closed curve open curve these curves are open in any one of its side as shown here their starting point is different from the end point closed curve curves whose end points join to enclose an area are called closed curves the starting point and end point of these curves are the same interior and exterior of a closed curve the area which is inside a closed curve is referred to as interior of curve the points a b c d e and f all lie in the interior of this closed curve the entire area which is outside of a closed curve is referred to as exterior of curve the points a b c d e f g and h all lie in the exterior of this closed curve linear and curvy linear figures if the boundary consists of straight lines then the figure is called linear figure in a closed figure if the boundary consists of curved lines then the figure is called curvy linear figure polygons a simple closed curve made of three or more line segments is called a polygon a polygon has at least three line segments the line segments of a polygon are named by the sides in it poly means many and gon means sides thus a polygon has many sides different polygons having definite number of sides are given names according to the number of sides a polygon with three sides is called a triangle a polygon with four sides is called a quadrilateral a polygon with five sides is called a pentagon a polygon with six sides is called a hexagon thus we have seen that polygons are shapes with boundaries as straight lines sides vertices and diagonals of a polygon this is a polygon formed with five line segments the line segments forming a polygon are called its sides this polygon has five sides ab bc cd de and ea the points at which the sides meet are called vertices this polygon has five vertices these are a b c d and e any two sides with a common end point are called the adjacent sides of the polygon the pairs of adjacent sides are ab and bc bc and cd cd and de de and ea ea and ab the end points of the same side of a polygon are called the adjacent vertices the pairs of adjacent vertices are a and b b and c c and d d and e e and a e. the joints of pairs of vertices which are not adjacent are called the diagonals of the polygon the diagonals of this polygon are ac ad bd be and ce let us revise the important points that we have studied in this lesson one open curve is a curve whose starting point is different from the end point two closed curve is a curve whose starting point and end point are the same three in a closed figure if the boundary consists of straight lines then the figure is called linear figure and if the boundary consists of curves it is called curvy linear figure four the area which is inside of a closed curve 
is referred to as interior of curve. 5. The entire area which is outside of a closed curve is referred to as exterior of curve. 6. A simple closed curve made of three or more line segments is called a polygon. 7. The line segments forming a polygon are called its sides and the points at which the sides meet are called vertices. 8. The lines joining of pairs of vertices which are not adjacent are called the diagonals.